this is a locust hill right across from a Dr. Luther King School. A U-Haul truck. It's on fire. It's, there is flames. Under the U-Haul truck, my apology. It's under the U-Haul, that's where the flames were. But it seems like the, the truck is now smoking. You know how it started? The lady is saying that uh, the fire was under the truck. When I arrived, I could see flames under the truck. This is exactly 106, 106 Locust Hill, right across from Martin Luther King School. The road is now closed. As you guys can see, the police cruisers all the way at the end. And the, the firemen are looking at the fire to make an assessment of how to pursue. The smoke is coming from under, under the truck. Guys, don't forget, if you want to support Yonka's voice, you can do so by sending some stars out of our way or by uh, subscribing to our YouTube channel, also Yonka's voice, following our Facebook page and by sending your friends our way. Hey, how you doing, man? I'm good. How are you? Okay, yourself? Family good?
special thanks, huge hug to all those that are sending stars our way. That's one way of recognizing the work that we do. To hey, how you doing? You know, you got you. No problem. As you guys can see, there is flames right there. I could see flames right under the rear left tire by where you see most of the smoke coming out. The firemen were taking some of the stuff, some of the stuff that was inside probably you guys, can you guys see the flames right there? So again, guys, this is 106, I believe. That's 106, I believe, Locust Hill, right across from Martin Luther King. Gente que habla español, estoy aquí en las 106 de Locust Hill. Como pueden ver, hay un carro de la U-Haul con fuego. El fuego está más o menos atrás de esa rueda, atrás de esta rueda. Estoy aquí en Locust Hill, mismo el cruzar de la calle, de Martin Luther King, la escuela. Como pueden ver, la calle está cerrada en este momento. Hay un carro de policía allá atrás que está cerrada. Y los bomberos trabajando, trabajando acá a poner el fuego, pero pone agua, el fuego va pasando un ratitito, aparece otra vez. So guys, the firemen are throwing water, but the water goes away and then it shows up. I still can see flames right there right there where they are putting water i see flames right there
I don't know if you guys can see the smoke coming from that hole inside the, tr the truck coming upwards. So guys, if you want to support Yonkers Voice for the work that we do, you can uh, do that by uh, sending us some stars our way. But not everything is about giving, donating money. You can also support by asking your friends to follow Yonkers Voice. You can also join our YouTube channel called the Yonkers Voice and Instagram also under the same name. We appreciate all the help you can give us. Okay join us send your friends our way everything is appreciated a la gente que habla español que pregunta cómo puedo podemos ayudar a Yonkers Voice miren a varias maneras de ayudar a Yonkers Voice nos pueden mandar unas estrellas pueden recomendarnos a, a los amigos de ustedes, sus amigos, sus familiares, y queremos gente de, de todo el mundo, de nuestros países latinos, gente de Yonkers, amigos que ustedes tengan, tengan en Yonkers. Nosotros también tenemos un, un canal en YouTube llamado Yonkers Voice. También nos pueden suscribir a ese canal y lo agradecemos mucho. How you doing? Okay, guys. Seems like uh, things he things here are under control. It's still smoking, I don't know.
Well, guys, thank you for watching. I think things are here under control. Fire department has the situation under control. Thank you for watching. Muchas gracias por, por mirar nuestro canal, por mirar nuestros videos. No se olviden que nos puedes soportar con decir a sus amigos que se juntan a nuestra página de Facebook. También importante es que agreguen nuestro canal de YouTube, Yonkers Voice. Porque a veces hay problemas con Facebook, pero nosotros vamos, continuamos por, haciendo el broadcast live on YouTube. So, es bueno seguirnos aquí en Facebook y también en YouTube. Guys, don't forget, I always tell you guys to follow us, subscribe to our YouTube channel as well as uh, following us here on uh, Facebook. Because once in a while we experience problems with Facebook for whatever, for whatever reason, we're not able to broadcast technical issues or whatever. And when we do experience technical issues on Facebook, we broadcast from YouTube. So it's good. If you don't want to miss a thing, if you want to always be on the know about what's happening in Yonkers, the best way is to follow us on Facebook as well as YouTube. Both places, both platforms, we are there under the name of Yonkers Voice, the source of local news. We report as is, where it is, and how it is, then it's up to you to formulate your opinion about what you see. We don't pass judgments. We don't say who's guilty, who's innocent, who's this or who's that. We show you the images and you formulate your opinion. Also, when we live on the scene, we're there very often at the very early stages. As you guys could see on this incident, we were here before the fire department, the first truck was just arriving here and we were already live. So very often when you report live, as the story is developing, there is always room for error because we are broadcasting it as the story is developing. 